These next examples are of directional selection acting on the beak depth feature of finch populations. Let's imagine that the habitat of these finches experiences a dry year which then changes the frequency of the different types of plant found in the habitat, with more and more plants possessing thicker seeds. Thus, those finches which would be best able to find food, and then also to defend a territory if male, or to produce more eggs if female, would be those with the thicker beaks. Thus, the feature of having a thick beak would increase in frequency in the population. And over time, the average beak depth of the population would change. This is directional selection. Directional selection could also move average beak depth in the opposite direction. If after multiple years of wetter conditions where plants with softer seeds predominate, favors the finches with narrower beaks. Thus, once again, the average beak depth in the population would change. And this is an example of directional selection.